Hello students, let us take up a question related to moving object, passing or crossing a stationary object having some length. So the question is, a train 150 meter long is running at 72 kilometers per hour. It crosses a bridge in 13 seconds. Find the length of the bridge. Now in this particular question, we are given the length of the train is 150 meters and the speed is 72 kilometers per hour which has to be converted into meter per second. We know that 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meters and 1 hour is equal to 3600 seconds. So we shall multiply 72 by 1000 and divide it by 3600. We shall get 20 meter per second. Now we don't know the length of the bridge. Let us assume the length of the bridge is A meters. Now, this question is related to moving object passing a stationary object having some length. So, the total distance covered by the train will be the length of the train plus the length of the bridge. Now, length of the bridge since it is not given in this question, we have assumed it to be A meters. So, the total distance covered will be the length of the train 150 meters plus the length of the bridge a meters which we have assumed so finally we can write 150 plus a meters is the total distance covered now this question is a case of direct variation why because more the distance to be covered more time it will take so we shall form a table showing x and y values x will represent the distance and y will represent time so in the x column we will write 20 and time column we will write 1 20 meters covered in one second so 150 plus a meters shall be covered in 13 seconds we will put this these values in the formula x upon y is equal to k so 20 upon 1 will be equal to 150 plus a upon 13 we shall cross multiply and we'll get 20 into 13 that is 260 is equal to 150 plus a now a will be equal to 260 minus 150 that is 110 meters